we have to learn to be more accepting or respectful of people's decision, even though we may not agree with it, or that's something that we may never ever do, or something that we're against. We have to respect people's decisions on how they choose to, if it's not breaking the law, or, or hindering you. In yes, kind of hindering you or like something against children. You know what I'm saying? Elderly people. Yeah. I'm not saying that. Like yeah. don't or don't like take this out of context your, and yeah. say or like out of your religion. Yeah, don't don't, don't do don't don't that's not what I'm saying or whatever. But respecting even if it is religion. Even if it's something that I do in my religion and and you doing yours and I don't agree with what you do in your religion or I don't agree with what you do what you do in your life because of my religion. I can't Call at the end of the man. day, yeah, I have free will. I mean, you have free will. We all have free will at the end of the day. Um, I can't, I have to respect your decision. Because if God respects your decision, why won't I respect your decision? Hola, welcome back to T. And Lee. TV. What you say now? What you do now? T and Lee, and we back with the crew now. Crap shrimp, and you know we review now. Cooking up all this real nice food now. What you said now? What you need now? Look on green screen HD now. Go ahead and subscribe, join the family. T and Lee is the place to be. All right, y'all. So welcome back to the channel. As you guys can see, we have Papa John's Pizza. We have the Chacaroni Pizza in the building. Yes. But before we get started to the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to T and Lee TV. Because it's the place to be, y'all. It's the place to be, y'all. Don't forget to check the description box down below for our personal channels. And it's Sonaya. So, tell them what we got on the menu, baby, besides so, Chacaroni. Oh, so... You got, you got to tell me what you got, what you got. Oh, well, I ordered, oh, you didn't look. I, didn't look. I ordered some, it's my first time having it, the chicken uh -huh. bites. It was the uh, Chipotle something, honey Chipotle. Oh. I don't know. I just wanted to try it. And then I got some, uh, some garlic parm wings. You yeah. got them. I, I wanted to taste them, but I was just like, no, nah, because it was, I don't know. I was thinking about it. I was like, should I get it, should I not? Because usually it's I wanted always them little I wings, them but I was like. Now I know they'd be yeah. small, so I yeah. took it off. And he put it back on. I didn't know he yeah. did that. So I got a, a Dr. Pepper to drink as well with yes. him. It's over here. And, of course, I got my cup of ice. So let's go ahead and bust food. We're going to show you what we got. Okay. Lord, we'd like to thank you for this food. And no harm shall come through this food. This food should be a blessing from you to us. And the Lord Jesus Christ, amen. Amen. So you want to reveal yeah, the pizza? Yeah, see some of that sauce waste out of that. Yeah. Some of y'all had the chacaroni before. Uh, chacaroni, right? Yeah, I think yeah. it's called chac chacaroni. Y'all, Lee uh, bought this when we were all sick. And I couldn't taste it, so couldn't taste it, <laughs> I couldn't taste it. But right, but what it. I could taste it wasn't too bad. We're gonna open this up together. I don't know what it right. like because they had it all sealed. Oh, they still got it sealed. Uh, oh, y'all, sealed for quality. That's what it says. Quality shield. Okay, okay. that's what it looked like. Y'all don't know the commercial be looking like more pepperoni. I'm just saying <laughs> it do be looking like more, but that's what it looked like. And then know. it do like more commercial. We're gonna pizza. show you. Yeah, it does. Even the first time we bought it, I was like, it looked like more in the commercial, more yeah. pepperoni, right? Okay, y'all. So we're gonna uh, plate this and come right back. Yep. Okay, guys. So we're back. Yes. We got our food together. So this is the um, honey chipotle boneless wings. This is the garlic parmesan um, chicken wings, and then we just put some pizza up here on the plate, and we have some ranch dressing yes. to go along with it. We do have a topic, oh, for today, um, as you can see from the title, but of course we're gonna eat first before we get into it, so. Yes. We did warm the pizza up, so it was kind of, uh, not warm. You see that, huh? <laughs> yes, let's taste it. Well, shot know what you're doing. I'm surprised you like it. It's kind of sweet. It is? Mm-hmm. The sauce? The sauce is kind of sweet. Ooh. Mm-hmm. It's a little hot. I need this meat level. <laughs> the shack meat level? Yeah. I'm going to dip this in ranch. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So I hope everyone is having a wonderful morning, evening, or afternoon. Yes. Whichever you're watching this. Let's see. I'm put it right there. Those wings are a lot bigger than what I expected. Mm hmm You know when I um when I was working for the hotel. Mm -hmm. 
Um, I order used to order the thin crust pizza from Papa John's. I remember. And the wings, uh, the barbecue wings. You always bring it home. Well, yeah. Actually, barbecue wings. Somebody put me. Oh, one of the guests put me on it, cause she ordered it one day. But the, that's when I found out that the wings are not all like puny. But I thought it was just the Papa John's in the area in the um the downtown Tampa area. I okay. just thought it was that one. Just doing big ones. Yeah, just doing big ones. Cause you know it depends on where you go. I guess yeah, I guess so. But some places, I guess they be saving them for themselves. Mm-hmm. Look at small this piece is. Mm-hmm. They cut it so small. Mm-hmm. Mmm, you not bad. First time having a bonus. The eat. honey, the honey, um, chipotle is good. Mmm. This one. This one. Mhm. That one. Huge. Like mine. Which one? Mhm. That one is huge. Yeah, I, I didn't go for them. <laughs> Y'all seem to like when we do pizza on the channel. Pizza is good, man. Y'all seem to really like it. I should have got some um, fresh red peppers and some. Um, oh, some yeah, Parmesan. Parmesan. Mm-hmm. That would have um, took it up a notch. I know y'all probably like, where your Pepsi? I got some. I just didn't want none. I just didn't want it right now. Yeah, I didn't want it. Yeah, my drink today, my soda of choice. Y'all know I do the one soda a day. Um, oh shoot! I just picked out the pepper for today. These are nice, but these remind me of Sonics. They do. Remember them Buffalo ones? The um, bonus ones that you always bring home. I used to bring them home all the time. To me? No, to me. Oh, oh. <laughs> I'm like, what? That's remind you. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mmm, that was crunchy. Mm-hmm. And the bonus, they'll give you 10 for like $7.50. And the bone in, they give you 8 for mm-hmm. eight fifty. <laughs> so you get less or more if you get the bone in. Mm-hmm. I don't know why. Because, I don't know. I used to think because... Some people with bonus wings, you mm-hmm. know how to be more bread than meat. Oh yeah, they do, do that. But some people bonus be good, but oh, I used to be like, cause it ain't real chicken. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you should think of real chicken. You should try one of those. I think you gonna like them. Pam, like so I did. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I like those more. You got, which ones? The bonus one. You do? Yeah. <laughs> Let's sniff. It smells like. Mmm. I smell the garlic. I mean, I smell the parmesan. Mm. No. I I really smell it. I don't smell the garlic. I don't think I smell nothing. What's this? Mmm. I'll never eat, eat that. I you know what? I forgot it was over there. You know what they should have did? What should have done? Ran this in the um oven twice. Oh, to harden up a little bit? Mm-hmm. And I don't ask for that. Mess around, you go get, go get something for you. Mm-hmm. Ask for. When I used to do the um, barbecue, I used to do that. But I ran it twice. It's a little loose. I'm trying to look for a little drumstick. Mm-hmm. This boy's all got some wealth to him. It don't really taste like, mm-hmm. Nothing, mm-hmm. It do taste, it don't taste like garden parmesan. It has a, I taste the salt content. I do, I taste something. But I don't taste like all the palm. Mm-mm, I don't. It's not bad, but I was. Y'all, I can't see. These do taste better. They do. Mm. What they cook them, though? These have. This one I bit had like a weird texture. Mm-mm. Mm, yeah, not that one. You don't like it? No, uh-uh, uh-uh. Let me see if I like it. Let me look at um, it. It has a weird texture. Mm. Of course, guys. <laughs> you got me stop. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I went 
be too young TV if the camera didn't stop. Yeah. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. <laughs> it is what it is. So hello to all of our um new supporters, subscribers, T Lizzy family. Whatever you want to call yourself. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. How you doing? Mm-hmm. Thank you for joining our family. Thank you so much, guys. Yes, we well, continue to grow. I just... We've been growing at a steady pace. But I'm just grateful that we continue to grow. Yes. We definitely do. Thank y'all for helping us get to 37K. Oh, yes. Thank you, guys. That's exciting. Yeah. Sometimes I look at it, sometimes I don't even look I know. at it. I don't even. That's how I be. Thank y'all for getting it's so nice to 63K. She almost at 64. Thank y'all for that. So we'll be celebrating it soon. Well, your pizza went. <laughs> oh, I ate it. Oh my god, I just noticed it. Your piece was big. Is that both pieces still together? It's both. Oh. No, no, it's that's one, and the other skinny one was right here. Oh. Yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy. That's a big piece. Shaq a big fella, so he had to make big pieces. He did. I think he. I think Shaq really put extra extra on his. I think since yeah. they made it, I think they made it look like extra, <laughs> oh, but did. it really wasn't. Because it don't look like a commercial. How many of y'all have had this and looked at it and it was like, what the rest of the pepperoni? You know what I'm saying? The rest of the G. Mm-hmm. Like, y'all sure may have seen like that whole thing was covered. You could barely see the cheese. Mm-hmm. But when you get it, I mean, like that. Mm-hmm. You know about the commercial. Mm-hmm. I would... If you're gonna advertise it like that, at least I know it's not gonna look exactly like the commercial because they dress it up, but at it least should. cover it more in pepperoni. That's why I went down there because mm -hmm. I seen the commercial. Mm -hmm. Why I went down there? So I get down there, you showing me a, 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 a I don't know what's the fancy car, a Tesla or whatever. Mm -hmm. And I get down there and I see a Volkswagen, mm -hmm. a Volvo. Mm -hmm. Volvo. You're lying. But it is good though. I don't know about that. It's thin. It's good. I like thin pizza. It depends on what it, it depends. Now, so, the topic, I don't know what I'm going to call this, but by the time you see this, you'll know. But I just came up. I was like, what should we talk about today? Shout out to everyone who really gets something out of whatever we talk about because. Usually it's just things that we've been through, maybe currently going through, that's on our minds, or that's just real life for us, that we talk about, and we're glad that it can help somebody else, yes. you know, but, you because know. Life is a place to be. <laughs> <laughs> it's just our opinions. Everyone does everything differently. It doesn't make us right. It doesn't make us wrong, and vice versa. It just makes it our opinion how we do things. So, as I'm saying this, I, I wanted to talk about, um, how should I name this? I guess I would say. God dang it. Can yeah. you get to it? Because I don't know what it is. It takes a long time. <laughs> because I don't know how to, um, I don't know what to name it. But basically, um, accepting people's differences, I guess you can say. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you never said it. You see, I gotta accept this one's differences. I gotta accept this one's differences. Accepting people's differences. Yes. Meaning or respecting people's differences. Mm. Maybe I should say that, respecting. There might be a, a better way to put this. Um, and the reason I'm, br I'm bringing that up is because I just notice more and more in life. Um, sorry. Go look at Go up, you like them? I like those. You like the flavor? Mm-hmm. You got, a little, you got like a little sweet, well, I know the barbecue, but it tastes a little spicy too. It's Chipotle. Oh. So, um, sorry. I know this more and more in life. Um, people are just very different on how they do everything. 
Mm-hmm. And sometimes it's not what you're used to, how you grew up, how you see things, whatever the case may be. But we got to know that just because it's not how you would have done it or you do it, doesn't make another person dumb or stupid for doing it. Like, that's something I just um, I just totally don't agree with. Like, people are so quick to call names because that's not the way you do it. Say, for instance, I'm going to give, like, a small example. Oh, you put up your cups with your plates, but once you separate all the cups and all the plates, that's stupid. You're dumb. Like, something as small as that until something as big as, oh, you spank your children. You know, or you don't spank your children. That's dumb. You're stupid. Like, we have to learn to be more accepting or respectful of people's decision, even though we may not agree with it or that's something that we may never, ever do or something that we're against. We have to respect people's decisions on how they choose to. If it's not breaking the law or, or hindering you. Yes, kind of hindering you or like something against children. You know what I'm saying? Elderly people. Yeah. I'm not saying that. Like, yeah. don't or don't like take this out of context your, and yeah. say. Or like out of your religion. Yeah, don't, don't, like don't, do, don't, don't. That's not what I'm saying or whatever. But yeah. respecting, even if it is religion, even if it's something that I do in my religion, and and you doing yours and I don't agree with what you do in your religion or I don't agree with you do what you do in your life because of my religion. I can't Call at the end of the man. day, yeah, I have free will. I mean you have free will, we all have free will at the end of the day. Um I can't I have to respect your decision. Because if God respects your decision, why won't I respect your decision in whatever you choose to do? Some people don't want to be saved. Some people don't want to go to church. Some people don't want to do what the Bible says. But God gives you free will. So he respects you enough to, he's a gentleman enough to let you choose what you do and what path you choose. So why am I jumping in and trying to make it seem like, um, not saying like I can't, like, you know, you know, people will take this video and they will probably try to, make it fit to what they want it to be. But people that understand, you know, you know what I'm talking about. I'm not going to, if you come to me about God and, or we're talking about that, I can voice my opinion. But at the same time, if you choose to do it this way, I have to respect that's your decision. Yeah, That's what I'm saying. So yeah, okay. I'm just learning more and more. On that too. Mm-hmm. I won't be a stripper. So you gotta respect my decision. No. Respect my decision. No. <laughs> so you're not gonna respect my decision. No, you're my husband. It's not the same. So you're not gonna respect my decision. Nope. Like you just said. Nope. <laughs> I can't believe you. You see how people will take it. This is a prime example. <laughs> I was doing that on purpose. How people will was, take yeah, it. Yeah, yeah that manipulate it. <laughs> like, oh, well, then you gotta let me, you know. Yeah, just give you guys. You know, I might not say respect much. Respect my um, you know. opinion on when to have a mistress. No, come on. Like, no, that's not what I'm talking about. Who know what we're talking about? Mm-mm. Okay, respect my decision if I want to have me a mister. Mm-hmm. 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 <laughs> Don't eat your last supper. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, like. That piece big. I'm, I don't think I want that. It is. You like, that mm. You get another one. So. On what, well, babe? You ask. So, guys, like. And don't come for Lee. I'm sick of y'all. The ones that be like, dang, Lee, why are you always eating? If I didn't want him to eat my food, I would tell him no. Or if I wasn't okay with it. So, if I'm okay with it, leave him alone. Oh, no. What? Don't want me to eat? No. You don't want you to check my food. Hmm. <laughs> but um, I learned that more and more Growing up When you mature and become an adult You learn more That you know things are not always what you think That yeah. they are Like everybody doesn't When I grew up I thought people only ate ranch on chicken wings mm. When I saw somebody put it on salad I was like What? Like That's my favorite who does that? That's disgusting. Mm. Why do you put ranch on salad? But that's because I didn't grow up doing it, so I didn't know any different. But yeah. now that I'm older, of course, it's just like, oh, okay, I understand that now. Or if you grow up like, whatever the case may be, even the way from the way you keep your home to how you do your, like, for instance, me and Lee, the way he organized the cabinet. The way you organized the refrigerator. <laughs> the way he organized stuff. It's different the way he does stuff. The way like, uh, I'm I'm gonna give another example with me and him. Like 
when we get new stuff, he want to throw away the old stuff. Yeah. What? We need all this stuff. I just now. don't understand that. I like get rid of the stuff. And the first thing I think is like that's so stupid. You just that's a waste of money. But yeah. that's I found out later that's how he was raised. So he just thought, yeah, that's what you do. So you can't always just be even though I don't agree with it still, I'd be like, okay, I understand why you feel that way because your mom raised you that way. But when you get new one, we get pots. We don't throw away old pots. We don't throw them away unless something is wrong with the old pots. If nothing is wrong with it, you keep your pots. Then we and got the new pots. The There's new pots. No, because we need more. That was the purpose. We need more. We don't got the same amount of eyes. Now you want to add more pots. Yeah, we need more pots. So, say for instance, you're cooking for Thanksgiving. You need another big pot. Like, I can't have only one size of one pot. You can buy a tinfoil pot. You can't boil it in tinfoil. But I make do. Anyways, but like little stuff like that, we've learned through the years. Mind you guys, me and Lee have been together almost 11 years, so we've learned a lot about each other, yes. and we've uh, accepted and learned certain things, and then certain things we have to compromise on. It's certain things we still don't agree with, yes. with each other, but at the end of the day, we have to respect each other's decision, and don't call names because you don't understand it, yeah. and that's that goes along with the way people raise their children. Mm -hmm. That goes along with the way people choose to live their life. Yeah, I would say, like... This conversation, that topic actually rolled into another topic of compromising. Yeah. Yeah. Cause That's another thing. That. So we could talk about that. That could be a next topic, another topic for another video because that is very important, especially yeah. in a marriage. And, yeah. And like any anything, like whether it's marriages, whether it's business, you got to get to like a, a flat partner. level ground. Yeah, Even you wars, do. you got to get to a compromise somewhere. It got to be a, a flat level. That's true. On so both sides. If y'all want us to talk about that, we can talk about that as well because we dig a little bit more deeper into that uh, that particular subject. So, yeah, definitely we will talk about that. But, yeah, accepting others' differences. So, um, I'm, I'm touching yeah. briefly on that topic. I can really go in on yeah, there, but I'm just, you know yeah. I can. I can go in. But Get her I'm, a bowl of ramen. <laughs> I will go in, but her go in. I'm going to keep it brief. Well, I'm... But <laughs> <laughs> so comment down below how you feel about that um as far as respecting uh, others opinions um a situation maybe that you have been in where someone did not respect your opinion or didn't respect your lifestyle or the way that you move but the thing is people always want you to respect the way they move but don't want to respect the way that you move and i don't get that listen all. hold on uh, we already gave a disclaimer now we're not talking about murderers that do <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah i already said that yeah they, man i love you you said something about it no but we're yeah, not talking to you y'all understand what i mean y'all know what i'm talking about but yeah, that's that's an interesting topic. So, light up the comment box down below, like Lee says. Let us know your opinions, thoughts, and concerns if you have any about this particular topic. Yeah, so that's it. We done. And we ate out. my pizza, his pizza. Had three pieces and a little piece. Okay, so and some of these wings that's supposed to be garlic parmesan that looked it really delicious. I'm gonna have to put those they, in the air fryer. They, they taste good. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna stun on them. Oh, they only yeah. hit one. Yeah, they taste good. But I'll those put them in the air fryer. Over there, I already got, I already got those. Well, we know what to get next time, so. I mean, I mean not that, but that. <laughs> okay, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Tenley TV because. It's the place to be, y'all. It is the place to be. We'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Bye.